We are full. Bye. Yeah. Back with another freaking video. Burst, Back burst. with another freaking video, man. Bring another one. It's true. We on fan base now, y'all. true. Yeah. This one. Day Before we get started, baby, go ahead and bring them on hey. in. What's going on? What's going guys, how you doing? Guys, what's good, y'all? How y'all feeling? Lamp. What's been happening, everybody? Give me some comments. Let me know what y'all got going on. It's summertime. It's hot everywhere. We know y'all are piping hot. Oh, summertime. We know y'all are piping hot. Hopefully, you are staying cool and enjoying your summer so far and what we got now, baby. Hey, so, man, we're going to do... We said we wanted to do this one. The EFF leaving and thrown out of the parliament compilation. So, I want to see... Um, they start getting the EFF members again thrown out. Ooh, y'all. Yes. I have been enjoying it. We are raising a very simple matter and we have followed the procedure. Following the constitutional court judgment, we wrote a letter to you to ask you to institute a disciplinary action against Mr. Zuma. Till today, you have not done anything. And our problem is that. The constitutional court ruling is going to be treated the same way you treated public protector's findings. And that will result in rendering that constitutional court redundant. Oh. And all of us sitting here we will be party to rendering the constitutional court useless by allowing the president to continue business as usual, even when there is a constitutional court ruling. It is unfair, it is unacceptable that this parliament does not see anything wrong. That even when the constitutional court has made serious findings against Mr. Zuma, there is nothing happening. No one has been disciplined, no one has been fired. Today, it must be business as usual. It's unacceptable, uh, uh, Honorable Speaker. <laughs> it is on the basis of that that we are asking you and asking this House not to allow the president to speak here up until there is a process to rehabilitate him. Mm. Uh -oh. There must Honorable be a rehabilitation Malema. process which Honorable Zuma is subjected to. That's what we are asking. I have given you ample time to make your speech, which was absolutely unnecessary, as <laughs> you know, because the issues you are raising are issues that have been put before properly constituted meetings of this honorable parliament and there are structures that you know you have to pursue if you want to pursue anything along what you are raising. I have written to you, Honorable Malema, and explained what I'm saying right now. Mm. And I am not allowing you to make another speech this afternoon. Mm. I am now proceeding with the business of this house. Speaker. Ah. I am not allowing any more. What? I mean, she went through all of that and she was like, I've already responded, bro. Yeah. yeah. Why are we taking the time at all. to doing this right here? Points from those benches, honorable members. Not the. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Y'all. Oh, speaker. No. I ask speaker. On the point of order, honorable members. Be, be disciplined. Honorable, honorable members, members, take your seats. Oh. Be disciplined. You must take be disciplined. Take your seats, you honorable members. Power. You must you be must disciplined. Our members, yeah. You ask us to stick by the rules, Mario. You don't stick by the rules. We said the rules are applicable today. No. Allow our members to speak. So, honorable members, you are clearly deliberately contravening the rules. Can we correct the misconceptions no. that you have been putting? It's not true that we agreed as the EFF in any committee whatsoever that a president that has broken his oath of office Honorable must come and answer Rosie, questions here. I now would like the to programming call. committee I'm which agreed about this from the said chamber. long before the, the, the constitutional court happened. You the must chamber. not mislead the country. Oh, wait. 
withdraw from the chamber, Honorable Dozier. No, no, I have done nothing wrong. The first person who has done everything wrong, the first person that must point in the chamber is the one who has broken an oath of office. Oh, man. An oath of office. The person who is living today is the one who must go. Who is the one who must go? No one must go. Who must not respect his oath of office? We're not leaving. Man, get to feel like they about to charge the stage. I huh? know, but why don't if they have the capability of turning the mics off? Why don't they just turn the mic? Or why maybe, do they just keep going back and forth? Maybe they can't cut them off like that. That is a waste. This of house time. today. We want to live here but as people. dead people. What language you can do speak, anything so you want to do. You don't understand us. No, Baba, Baba. It's not going to happen. Don't even waste our time. We're not going anywhere. Come out. We are not going Zuma anywhere. Zuma is the one who must withdraw. Exactly. You are withdrawing a wrong person. Mm -hmm. Zuma is the one who must go. The surgeon then arms must go and tell Zuma to go now. Surgeon of arms tell Zuma to go. Chairperson. Surgeon of arms tell Zuma to leave. Chairperson. Chairperson. That criminal must go. Oh. Zuma. Wait. Can you see? Person who must leave this house is Zuma. You can kill us the way you want to do it. We are not scared of anything. Where is Zuma at? Honorable, Honorable, Honorable Johnson, do you have a point of order? On a point of order, Chairperson. Yes, Honorable Johnson. Is it parliamentary for a young person to call? There is no young person no here. Young person here. here. There, there is no young person <laughs> Well, he's probably saying that they're younger than he is, yeah. so I would guess he's talking about them. Yeah, of course. Right. No young person. No fail. No fail. Sit down and enjoy your salad. Sit down and enjoy your salad. Sit down if the presiding officer is of the opinion that a member is deliberately contravening a provision of these rules, what provision? Zuma, Zuma is oh, the one who must what what the house. You are he not respecting the those provisions. Zuma must go. You are not he is respecting those provisions. The authority of the chair. Or that a member's conduct is grossly disorderly. Read 51 he together with or 52. She <laughs> may order the member to withdraw immediately from the chamber. Which one? For the remainder we are so impatient of the days. Us. Why don't you listen to It's like us. she's reading it and she, she ain't even raising a blood pressure, a blood vessel. She's like, uh -uh. look. Well, I'm going to read this and y'all going to go. But the thing is, I don't understand why they, they have the capability of turning their, ma their mics off. Each person is different. Whoever gets up there in that chair, excuse me, they're different. Some people will say, turn off the mics. She's not saying that. I was wondering, like, you cut a mic off, is it in fear that somebody might start cutting up and they start sh running up, shouting? I don't know. Not if that's a government party. <laughs> that's not like the people. They be bucking. Zuma has therefore, agreed that he deliberately broke the constitution. I call and even upon a It's an admission. To do what? Honorable no. Low. To no. do what? Honorable Shibambu. What's your problem? Honorable Malema. Honorable What Mente. did I do? Tell me my problem. Honorable Matias. Don't address me what as a I group. Honorable <laughs> <laughs> What did I do? Yeah. Honorable Kaula. Oh. Honorable Mbata. Honorable Mukauze. What did I do? Why are you calling Zuma out my name here? The All one these one honorable one members one must one withdraw one from the one chamber. One honorable members withdraw from the house. I now <laughs> have an entry protection.
protection services to assist in addition to those members Honorable Mashabela, That's Honorable crazy. Sonti, oh, yes, so Honorable Muteka, yeah. Honorable Machobeni, yeah. Honorable Ntobongwana, yeah. Honorable Matsuku, yeah. Honorable Musongo, yeah. Honorable Ketabase, yeah. Honorable Khao. Uh -oh. oh. They're ready. Honorable Look at the whole squad. Let's go. Honorable Koza. Oh, okay, let's go. Oh, oh, oh! Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Did a fight? Was that hey? Let's go. Hit, hit the thing. Hit the thing. Oh, hey. oh my God! No! Oh, oh, oh! They got bastards flying. Oh, oh, oh! That's a darn shit. That dude the black, he was like, with the black sweater, you go get out of here. You go get out of here. They are not playing. Bro, oh my God. Oh my Somebody goodness. Somebody being carried out. They were throwing stuff. Just leave me, people. Just leave. Wow. Oh my gosh. I was not expecting All this. I hear is that on 3 six, tear the club up. <laughs> Got a club. <laughs> Where's that basket on the floor? Is that bread or what? It's all just basket flying. <laughs> Where'd they come from? Oh my god. They still fighting. Ooh. They bucking, bruh. And all the noise is coming from the people of the top. Listen. And shout out one of the guys who's one of the subscribers. He's a part of. The, he's a part of the EFF. He's what? Like, oh my god! He's a part of the EFF. I'm like, what? bro. <laughs> oh man, that is crazy. That's yeah. crazy, bro. Wow. Bro, wow. Y'all be tearing it up in there. Be tearing it down. This is Parliament, and the rules of Parliament will be applied. Uh, appropriately, and I'm, I'm going to refer this matter. Uh, Honorable Malema has made two uh, pronouncements in the House, in the podium. The first one is his calling on people to occupy land. Honorable occupy Malema land. Uh, swore to obey by the Constitution and by all other laws. When he says what he says there, uh, I think raises very no. oh. whoop, questions. Whoop. Julius about to fuck. It's the same Julius one that got into it the last time. And secondly, the last oh, one to repeat, repeat the it, last they must point. occupy land. Honorable you can member. do whatever you want to do, they must occupy land. There's nothing you can do, there's nothing this parliament can do with or without you. Doesn't Dun Julius look like Shine? Remember Shine? Whoa! <laughs> You remember that? He looked, Julius looked like shine somewhere, for real. Somewhere, somewhere. People are going to occupy land. We require no permission from you, from the president, from no one. We don't care. We can do whatever you want to do. Who are you to tell us whether we can occupy land or not? We are going to occupy land. Yes. South African occupy land. That's Thank who you. we are. Honorable member, you want to do? Speaker, can withdraw my member from this useless parliament? Oh, 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 useless. Honorable member, I'm speaking. Oh, Please man. take your seat. I will point you out. Just take your seat. Honorable members, I am pointing that out because I think it's a serious, contemptuous uh, violation of the rules, but also contempt of the chair, and it has been expressed as such. And I think this matter must be taken up in the appropriate structures. And I do refer it to the speaker directly because I think this is unacceptable and we will not accept it. On a point of order. Yes, what's your point of order, Honorable Member? What rule? What's your point of order? Look at his face, bro. He's like, I said all that. Now what you got to say? What's your point of what? But why even address them? I don't get it. I don't get it. Oh, my God. This is hilarious.
I've got food in the kitchen and you're disturbing me. I'm hungry. He got that he got that <laughs> hungry look on his face, bro. Look at that. <laughs> you're wrong. Moon, are you quoting that forbids the commander in chief speaking about land occupation in South Africa? We have got absolute freedom of expression in this parliament, as is outlined in the constitution and the rules of this house. Honorable what member. rule are you using to forbid any expression? Because that's a point of debate. If you disagree with the occupation of land, why don't you state it yourself from there? Honorable because member. What you're saying is illegal. Honorable but member. the one who's illegal are going to subject you to the appropriation, to the process of rules committee. And he said this. He said, I think I four, five. Three. <laughs> I'm like, you from, from misrepresenting the rules of this house. Why do you undermine the constitution like that? Honorable member, thank you very much. Oh. Uh, honorable member, I've made a ruling and I would like to move us to the next speaker. Honorable the Minister uh, and the Presidency, Planning and Monitoring. On a, on a point of order, Deputy Speaker. Honorable member, uh, this <laughs> You matter, said you are going to point me uh, and I, I, I respected yes. you. Speak? Yeah. <laughs> you must always be reminded of your duties. No. You don't you, like peace in any member, way. Honorable member. Nobody has complained about the speech of the, uh, of, the, uh, of the speaker on the podium. From nowhere, you just want to appease and make the white monopoly capital and white races oh. to be happy oh. about the issue of your stance on land. Honorable member. Nobody has complained to this you, is uh, not uh, uh, Honorable member. Speaker. This what is, are you trying to achieve? This is neither procedure that's your problem no, you're even replying instead of take making a seat, ruling honorable you are member. just uh, descending into the take arena your, take your seat honorable member that's all you know no honorable member this matter is not on the agenda again no the, honorable the member speaker. no Deputy Speaker. No, Honorable <laughs> Member. Speak on the point of order. We have said, on Honorable point Member, of order, Deputy Speaker. this matter has been addressed. On a point of order. I have Deputy made Speaker. a ruling on this matter. No, but I'm raising a point of order. You don't know what I'm going to say. Honorable Member, I've raised... You don't raised know what I'm going to say. You can't say I've ruled on an issue that I'm still going to speak about now. Honorable <laughs> Member, I'm let's, going to... Let's, let's make a simple illustration to you. The rules of the National Assembly. Only, you can only pass a ruling... When another member has <laughs> called the point of order. Yeah, I, heard, I was listening. He was rolling. They all do the R's like that. that. They all do the R's. So all we need to help you put, put on some game. But ruling. That's right. Let's ruling. go. I love it. It's a one. <laughs> <laughs> that is a die roof. Yeah. I love it. I love it. The, I, but now me hearing him and listening, I'm just The Wawa like, said roof. Roof. Wawa. Dog. I just ow! I just hear I just hear uh, the rrr, a lot, so I'm like, okay, it's like I'm hearing my subconscious now. Okay, yeah. I say. Down what is said there. You are not there to interfere and put sentences and commas on the statement mm. of. I've been trying to practice my accent. You are not there to interfere to put instances and commas. I'm trying to get my get my accent. Well, what so. you trying to get it together for? Um, acting roles, African. Okay, Everybody told me I got that African go. look to him. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> Members of Parliament, you have got no, you have got no right like that. You have got no such permission. The courts doesn't allow member. you. So don't, don't Honorable allow member. your objectivity Honorable to, to undermine this process of land debate. If you want to express your views, go ahead and express it wherever you're going to express it, but not interfere Honorable with speakers member. when they speak here. Take land your... is going to be occupied and we're not apologetic about it. We can say it here in Honorable Parliament member. and we'll continue to say it. Take your... I think EFL, I feel like EFL be bucked by everything. We will wash our cars anytime we want. <laughs> I feel like they fucking about everything. Yeah, that's funny. It, uh, we are not going to proceed on this line. No. Chair. The answer is no. But you don't even know. You can't yes, just say answer, no to me. No, the answer is no. Those ANC like, ministers just stand up and members, say things. This honorable honorable your members. ANC ministers have been co doing corrupt things here. They follow no rules and you want to come and preach to us about rules. We are going to occupy land. Uh, honorable members, we have uh, dealt with this Chair. matter. We have dealt with this matter, no members. I don't know what you are debating. Chair. We don't know what you are debating. Chair. All, members, all of you take your seats. Chair. Oh, oh we're debating. Take your seat, honorable <laughs> members. Chair. I want to speak to you. Take your seats. I want, I want to make a point. No, no, no. Take your seats. 
That land is going to be occupied by our people. It's going to be occupied. Honorable oh. member, you are being contemptuous on a point of, of the rules, on a point of, uh, of the chair, and of what I have said on this matter. On a point of order, members. Deputy Speaker. Yes. On a point of order, Deputy no. Speaker. On a no. point of order, Deputy Speaker, no, my hands have been long up and you are ignoring me. You have seen me. My hands have been long up, Deputy Speaker. Honourable members, I have On exhausted. a point of order, Deputy Speaker, I demand to speak here. I'm a member of Parliament. I demand to speak here. My hands have been long up and you have been ignoring me. We will occupy unoccupied land and that is a fact. Let me, let and me whether point you out to are cowardice to do it, EFF members must do it, the communities must do it, they must take it. Honorable My member, hand was up, you are ignoring me. Honorable Why member, are you ignoring me? They just be blocking. Yeah. Of parliament just like you. Honorable member, listen to the chair. No point of order may be raised in response to a considered ruling in terms of sub rule five. You continue to do that, and you are violating the rules. I know, honorable member, Under you can, Lan. I have, no. Sir Lan. Member, no, you are not going to be allowed. <laughs> if you insist, honorable no. members, if you insist on, no, 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 it's not going to happen, because it is clear you are all <laughs> racist. <laughs> <laughs> All my, so, so all my people that's watching is she is that zulu what is she speaking yeah what is she um i so, doubt if an african africans because i heard africans is more of like um white or well, whatever she's speaking he is like oh he no. said he did this he said oh <laughs> <laughs> Honorable members, uh, uh, honorable members, honorable uh, members, honorable member, take your, seat. take your seat, honorable members, we are proceeding now. Deputy Speaker, can we raise a motion uh, of no confidence on you? You get out of the chair, the Speaker goes back. You are degenerating the house. Every time you sit there, there must be something wrong with you. I told you, mm. I, I told you. I said I wanted the MDL with the peanuts. But how, I mean, how are they able to get anything done? It's a constant argument Argue. back and forth, back I, and forth. I think once the problem is raised, it's... It feels like it's the nature to everybody to stir it, stir it worse, stir the pot harder. That's why I feel like it's like once it start, you and you piss one off, stir it, everybody. But my question is, what does this group stand for? What are what are what is? We have to look it up. It's yeah, well I, I want to know there. what they, you know, because it seems like a lot of decisions that the parliament make, the parliament makes. They are. They go against it. Yeah. It's not like they're in agreement very often with right. what they're saying. Right. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm curious to know. We gotta look that up because I want to know what they are fighting for compared to what they think the government is not doing. We want VIP parking, honorable member. Stop it. I don't understand why they just so cut out the mics. I mean, they go on for too long.